Warships have a very important role for navies around the world. Warships are considered important because they are designed for security and defense, power projection, support for maritime operations, control and command of the sea, implementation of foreign policy, and response to crisis. The role of warships continues to evolve with time and technology. In the modern era, warships do not only involve combat ships, but also involve submarines, aircraft carriers, patrol ships, fast attack ships, frigates, and destroyers with various special capabilities and roles. Therefore, as much as possible, each country designs its warships as well, as strong and as sophisticated as possible, as is done by several countries, such as the UK, the US, and Germany. They are building frigates, the British Type 26, the German F-126, and the US FFG-62, equipped with unrivaled technology and capabilities. Let's take a look at the capabilities of each of their new frigates and which one deserves the Super Frigate title? Germany's F-126 Frigate F-126 Frigate is a new German warship intended to replace the F-123 class frigates of the German Navy. These ships will be the largest super frigates of the German Navy since World War II. At the beginning of December, the F-126 project reached an important milestone with the first steel cutting for the German Navy's new super frigate, meaning the construction phase of the F-126 project officially began. The F-126 super frigate has a displacement of 10,550 tons, a length of 166 meters or 544 feet 7 inches, a beam of 21.7 meters or 71 feet 2 inches, a height of about 39 meters or 127 feet 11 inches, a draft of 5.9 meters or 19 feet 4 inches. It has a full speed of 26 knots or 48 kilometers per hour and has a range of around 7,400 kilometers at a speed of 80 knots. This super frigate is equipped with one Hensoldt TRS 4DNR multifunctional surveillance radar and one Thales gatekeeper. The new German frigate F-126 is equipped with advanced weapons, including one Otobreda 127 per 64 naval guns with volcano-guided ammunition, eight Kongsberg NSM Block 1 A anti-ship and land attack missiles, 16 MK-41 VLS cells, for up to 64 ESSM medium-range air defense missiles, Block 2B, two CIWS Ram RIM 116 launchers, Rhine Metal MLG 27mm automatic cannon, Leonardo 12.7mm heavy machine gun, water guns, and long-range acoustic devices. The German Navy will soon have a highly advanced and deadly warship like it has never had before when the first F-126 is commissioned in 2028. Royal Navy's Type 26 Frigate The Type 26 City-class frigate is touted as the Royal Navy's most advanced and most capable anti-submarine warfare warship. The Type 26 frigate is designed to carry out a wide range of missions, including anti-surface warfare, strikes against land targets, and critical protection against continuous at-sea deterrent and carrier strike groups. The Royal Navy will replace its aging Type 23s with Type 26 frigates. The T-26 frigate is equipped with cutting-edge technology, advanced weapons, communication systems, and advanced sensors. The Type 26 has a displacement of 6,900 tons and 8,000 tons at full load. She was 149.9 meters, or 400, 91 feet 10 inches long and had a beam of 20.8 meters or 68 feet 3 inches. The ship has a speed of more than 26 knots or 48 kilometers per hour with a range of more than 13,000 kilometers driven by an electric motor. The Type 26 is equipped with a Type 997 Artisan 3D radar, Kelvin Hughes Sharp Eye Navigation Radar, Terma Scanter, 6002 DX band navigation radar, 2087 sonar, Type 2150 ultra electronic bow sonar, and Scott 5 SATCOM. The advanced weapons installed on Type 26 include two 24 cell VLS for 48 C Scepter anti air missiles, one 24 cell MK 41 VLS for various missiles, including 
Future Maritime or Anti-Ship Weapons? 1MK Naval Cannon, 45, 62 calibers, 5-inch guns, 2 times 30 millimeter, DS, 30 MMK 2 guns, 2 times Phalanx CIWS, 4 times General Purpose Machine Guns, or 0.50 caliber heavy machine guns. The first frigate, HMS Glasgow, will enter service in 2028, and by the end of 2033, construction of the entire ship is expected to be completed. The FFG-62 Frigate The US Navy is back building new frigates after a hiatus of 35 years. The new multi-mission guided missile frigate is known as the USS Constellation FFG-62. The ship is based on the European multi-purpose frigate Fremham, which is already in service with the French and Italian navies. The US Navy plans to build 20 Constellation class frigates. Fincantieri Marinette Marine began construction of the US Navy's first Constellation class frigate in August last year. USS Constellation FFG-62 has a displacement of 7,291 tons, a length of 496 feet or 151.18 meters, a beam of 65 feet or 19.81 meters, and a speed exceeding 26 knots or 48 kilometers per hour. The ship is equipped with the Aegis Baseline 10 combat system, ANSPY 6V3 Enterprise Air Surveillance Radar ANSPS 73V18 Next Generation Surface Search Radar Thales Group CAPTAS 4 Low Frequency Variable Depth Sonar TB37 Multifunction Crane Array and ANSQQ 89V16 Undersea Warfare or Anti Submarine Warfare Combat System. The FFG-62 is also equipped with two SLQ-32V Six Surface Electronic Warfare Improvement Program, Block 2, 4, Mark 53, Nulka Decoy Launch Systems, and an AN-SLQ-61 Light Towed Torpedo Defense Mission Module. The US Navy's new frigates also have very sophisticated weapons, including 32 Mark 41 VLS cells with BGM-109 Tomahawk cruise missiles and RIM-162 ESSM Block II and RIM-174 Standard ERAM. Additionally, RIM-66 Standard SM-2 Block III-C, 16 over-the-horizon tube-launched anti-ship guns, RIM-116 rolling fuselage missile launched from MK-49 guided missile launch system, 21 cells, MK-1 1057mm gun meters, will also be integrated into the FFG-62 frigate, making this warship very deadly. USS Constellation, scheduled to enter service in 2026, currently has six on order and one under construction out of a total of 20 ships that will strengthen the US naval fleet in the future.